What's good everyone, Infamous Legacy here from the Game Haulers and here is our video on the 2024 Video Game Expo that took place in Toronto. With this expo, it was myself, Pokey Gaffer, Retro Rat 64 and Big Sun Zone that attended this event. During this video, I'm just going to be explaining to you guys our experiences with this event, what we picked up, what we encountered and what was so fun about it. So first off, I can definitely say the event was really fun and it was also really busy because this event, when you were trying to get around certain tables to view what the vendors were selling, it was hard because it was so crowded. You can see right here, we have a lot of Pokemon TCG that was being sold and other Pokemon items. Shout out to the Poke Gaffer because that dude right there was hunting for those Pokemon cards. And then we also have video games from PS4 xbox game boy whatever you want to call it they had modern games they had retro games all at this video game expo and we also had vendors bringing out their own artwork that they wanted to sell here you can see a dude selling swords i was actually looking for a dragon ball z future trunk sword but the dude didn't know what i was talking about so unfortunately i couldn't get what i wanted but then we also encountered some great art pieces that i mentioned here so here you can see some great art being showcased by one of the vendors that attended and more pokemon toys and you know stuffies whatever you want to call it pokemon trading card right here as well that you can pick up and the prices with this event it was pretty decent to be honest there had to be negotiating going on so if you are attending any kind of video game expo make sure you're ready to negotiate with vendors always make sure you give them a realistic figure when you're buying their product because if you don't they're just going to decline it here you can see a table with a lot of sealed products so this one right here had a lot of sealed games in box and there were a lot of retro games and they were also doing consoles but it was a pretty steep price i was personally looking for ps4 games but it seemed like a lot of the games on my wish list that i wanted were either gone or were not available and we have more pokemon toys so there was a lot of pokemon toys that were being sold at this event and there were also a lot of other anime figures as well and then here we have you know just a little promoting going on of an event that this vendor is going to be you know showcasing soon and then we have a lot of pop figures that were being showcased at this event as well. And again, with the prices, they might be a little bit more than retail, but that's again where negotiation comes along. And if you're carrying cash to an event like this, you're probably better off doing that because you can negotiate at a decent price and just offer cash and not get taxed on anything. And again, we have more vendors showcasing what they were selling. Very busy event. Again, it was just hard to get around the crowd earlier during the day to see what these vendors were selling. And they did have two different types of admissions going on. So myself, Pokey Gaffer, Retro Rat, and Big Sun Zone, we went with the general admission where we can attend the event at 12 p.m. But then they also had tickets available for people who wanted to enter earlier which were the vip tickets so if you did attend with the vip access you might have had an advantage of picking up items that weren't available later on so that's something that we might be looking into for the next year because this event really did showcase a lot of great things and there also they had a lot of fun events also taking place within the expo for example they had like a video game booth from retro consoles to modern consoles that a lot of people can play they had some cosplay things going on but you know us game haulers we weren't really into the cosplay type of thing we were just going for that game hunting experience pokemon trading cards other trading cards figures toys all that good stuff and in terms of the items that we picked up during this event myself i picked up a couple japanese imported gundam games from an import guy that was here at that video game expo shout out to him he was probably one of the best video game vendors out in this expo i also picked up some pop figures and also a final fantasy 8 strategy guy with the playstation 1 version of the game big sun zone also picked up some imported games with some pop 
figures. RetroRat64 also picked up some Sega Genesis imported games. And the Poke Gaffer, he did his Poke Gaffer thing and picked up some Pokemon TCG at this event. And during this event, we also encountered the Batman right here on his Batmobile to end off our day. It was a very exciting event, very fun. The game haulers, we will be attending more game expos in the future and more videos will be coming. I hope you guys enjoyed this one and our experience at the 2024 Toronto Video Game Expo. Hit that like and subscribe button. Infamous Legacy out. Peace.